but no, I was just, I'm out here looking at the water, it's nice, and then obviously I got, I I ignored the first call, I ignored the second call, and the third one comes out, I'm like, okay, I'll go out there, I'll go make contact with him, I'll say that he's a cool dude, and I'll freaking go back home, and I'll, uh, I'll start. I'm going to say you're a cool dude. Yeah, exactly, I appreciate it. <laughs> and there's a guy with a AR style gun strapped across his chest. He's not being rude or acting weird or anything like that. I'm, I'm being a Karen a little bit, you know. I, I ignored the first call, ignored the second call, and the third one comes out, I'm like, okay, Jeez, come on, guys. I'll go, out there, I'll go make contact with him. I'll say that he's a cool dude, and I'll well, go back home. And, that, I'll, uh, I'll and I'm going to say you're a cool dude, yeah, too, yeah, man. I'm glad we're sitting here talking, dude. I mean... Why? Why? You know the deal. But actually, share the hell out of this video. I mean, oh my god. Uh, my brain hurts. Don't forget to hit that like, share, and that subscribe button. It just hurts me. It hurts. It hurts so bad. 11, 19 a.m. 18 second February 7, 2022. Beach Police, Operator 4. I'm sorry, what was that? Beach Police, Operator 4. Operator for okay. Um, yes, ma'am, I am down at the county pier, okay. um, and there's a guy with a AR-style gun strapped across his chest. He's not being rude or acting weird or anything like that. Okay, is he I actually on he, the pier or is he on the beach? Yeah. Yeah, he's on, he was walking down the boardwalk and then walked down the pier with so a fishing pole. Oh, yeah, a fishing pole and a tactical vest and a... What looks to be a you know an AR style rifle. White right male, black male. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, white male. He, he, he's like I said, he, he. When I was staring at him, we're sitting in the truck eating lunch. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. I was staring at him and just gave a smile and uh, and waved. He's obviously just trying to make a point. You know what I mean? Right. One of those guys. But oh, yeah, you know, I just, fishing gear. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, like I said, he walked uh, walk down uh, the walk down the yeah walk down the sidewalk and then walk down the pier. It just seems rude, you know what I mean to me. I'm I'm being a Karen a little bit, you know, but uh, I just didn't know if we had any city ordinance about open carry or or anything like that. Um, I'm not real sure, officer. I'll have to deal with that one. Uh, yeah. Did you want to contact you know, with an officer? No, I do you, just do you, you know, work at I mean, the pier or you just. No, no, okay. we're just sitting here eating lunch. I'm about to be gone. Okay. I just, I just thought it was odd. Some, some guy trying to, trying to prove a point about his, his pet gun. You know. Gotcha. But, uh, okay. You know. Just... Do you mind giving me your first name, sir? Yeah. That's just in case I have to call you back. Yeah. Okay, I'll just yeah, like check the, it the out. Guys, yeah, the guy's obviously doing it on purpose, you know what I mean? Okay. It's, it's, just, it's just a stunt. He's not acting weird, and there's other people out on the pier and everything else, but I okay. just think, you know, I'm I'm from here, and this guy looks like a tourist trying to make a point. 1121. Okay, so I'll get somebody out there. Yeah, all right. All right, thanks. thanks. All right. Missouri 3, Adam Frank, Robert 05. What's up, brother, man? How's it going? How's the fishing? I wish it was warmer, but hey. Yeah, I hear you. It ain't that bad. It's still beautiful out here. I hear you. I hear you. How are you? Pretty good, man. Just making it. Just chilling. So far, so good. So far, yeah. Not too bad. That's all you can ask for. Yeah, exactly. Wish you were fishing. I got an extra pole. No, <laughs> trust me, I'm fine. I wish I was right now, but give me a couple hours and I'll be out here with you. All right, bro. I promise. Like yeah, nobody's giving you a hard time, are no, they? No, no, no. I am giving, and I'm not giving anybody. I know, trust that. I'm out here just to make sure you're good and they're good. So. Yeah, yeah I, I talked to maybe a couple of people, said hi. Um, a lot it. of people don't know the laws out here, so yeah, yeah, I no, mean, it's okay. and, and, you know, you, get, you came out here very respectful. Yeah. No, no worries. No, I'm um, not. Yeah, yeah it, 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 happens. It, it happens on the regular for me sometimes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, you think you're going to get a shark or something? <laughs> no, no, no. 
unfortunately, <laughs> like I, I, a true story, I'm not going to lie to you about No, that. yeah, I'm here. I'm listening. I'm listening. Um, I was in Cocoa Beach. Okay. All right, and I'm um, yeah, doing the same. Actually, I was actually fishing for crabs that day. Nice. But anyway, um, long story short, mm -hmm. they showed up. And, um, when law I enforcement or? Law enforcement. Oh, okay. And I turned around and um, I, I vaguely thought I saw him point his gun at me. Really? And this is before the vest. I, like, like I, oh, I, but you I, had the AR with you, though. I had an AR. Oh, okay. I was, just, I was just sitting there in t t-shirt and a bag. Baggies and t-shirts and sandals. Right. <laughs> I, don't, I don't wear anything. Like, <laughs> but unfortunately, on, from that day, um, when he directly lied to my face. Oh, really? He, I, I was like, dude, your gun was, and he's like, oh, I didn't point it at you, but when I got his body cam, that's mm. when, um, you know, you can't, lock, the camera don't care. About yeah, exactly. Your, yeah. The camera's just there. Camera don't lie. I'm like, I'm recording. Yeah. I, yeah, yeah. So, it, I mean. A, and that's the thing. It's for your benefit and mine. I yeah. can't say I did this, and then you say the camera's just there. Exactly. So, but that, that was that's when the vest. First came name out. Robert. Okay. Oh, I say I haven't seen a vest yet. I've seen guns. I don't because I do the same thing. If I'm hunting or fishing, I got mine too. But I so everybody's just like, I mean, I'm scared that something might happen. That he has a vest. I was like, oh, okay. So who who really cares? <laughs> yeah, my, my, I've never had I've never had a citizen ever try to mess with me like that. Right. But it was I've had gun I've had. Law enforcement point guns at me before and say, you make a move, I'm going to shoot you. Yeah. I've had it happen to me a couple times. And when I say, we're almost putting it on two hands at this point. Yeah. And, you know, people are scared for my life. And I'm like, well, i got to protect myself. So True. I mean, you have that right. That's yeah. what's great about this country. Oh, yeah, I love this country. <laughs> yeah, that, exactly. You know? I mean, right now, I, I see some things the ATF is trying to dabble into. Like, right. like this thing right here. Yeah. I, have, I heard a, it's a memo coming out and... In June or June, July or something like that, that's going to actually give it an answer to these braces. Really? So, hmm. um, these, these, that's crazy. these things might go away. I don't know. The, wow. Oh, yeah, well, they already took my bump stocks away. I'm a little upset about that. <laughs> it's like, dude, it's a piece of plastic. Yeah. It's like, come on now. <laughs> you know, and same thing with um, the force reset triggers right now. Yeah. They're in the same boat. They, they're, um, there's all the saying saying they were seized, they weren't seized, they got raided, they didn't get raided. Yeah. Right now, the ATF is knocking on their door, so there is. <laughs> they're just... knocking on their door, so they're coming. Dude. Yeah, I I so. can't. I don't understand why people are trying to. They expect us like, hey, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna start taking people's guns away, uh, but we're gonna have the police officers do it. Uh, no, nope. I ain't taking nobody's guns away because uh, that yeah, means they're like coming. Y'all coming to take my guns away too? We're gonna have yeah, a problem. Yeah. <laughs> we're all in so, the same boat. It's exactly. Like, you know, and, and same thing like with most all politicians. Yeah. And even yourself, you all swore an oath to protect this. Exactly. Not uh, for all these laws. Yeah, we're not trying like, to infringe on it. Yeah. No, it's like all these laws. You keep making more, but you're giving us less back. Yeah. So, you know, and Florida's fighting for it. I mean, that's what I love about Florida right now. I mean, I'm from Memphis, Tennessee, and okay. it's they they're just a little bit too liberal for me, so I had to get out of there. And now <laughs> I'm fine. I'm glad I'm at this this oh, yeah. place here because the, no the northern half of Florida is yeah. a very yeah this very is very conservative. Yeah, it's weird because when you go down south in Florida, it gets worse. I'm like, what? <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, don't ever go to Miami, man. <laughs> <laughs> I've been a Miami few times for spring break, and I yeah, I won't, I won't be going back. It's a, it, I mean, it's, it's one of those things. I did it. That's it. Yeah. I'm over it. Yeah, yeah. I say I got that on my system. Let's yeah, let's not do that again. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. You go down there on. You go down there on vacation, leave on probation type of stuff yeah, sometimes. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I mean, I ain't going to lie. I mean, that, here on spring break, that's how it's going to be here, too. We start oh, cracking okay, down we'll on see. spring break. Yeah, oh, yeah, we start cracking down on spring break. But oh, yeah. for those couple, I mean, like, what, two months out of the whole entire year, just maybe try to avoid it. Yeah, yeah. I say try to avoid it for two months and yeah. come back and have a great time. Yeah. But and other than that, yeah, Miami, it's just every day. Every day down there. So yeah, it's like, exactly. That's it's insane. Yeah, I, but I, no, I was just I'm out here looking at the water. It's nice, and then obviously I got I had, I ignored the first call, ignored the second call, and the third one comes out. I'm like, okay, I'll go out there. I'll go make contact with him. I'll say that he's a cool dude, and I'll freaking go back home and yeah. I'll uh, I'll you know, start. I'm gonna say you're a cool dude. Yeah, exactly. I appreciate. You. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I've had I've had good, and I always try to start out every interaction. I'm like, hey, what's going on, man? Which that like, should be. Yeah, and, exactly. And, and, if I'm actually doing something, hey, you know something, I'm, a, I'm, I, I, I do the manly thing. If I'm in the wrong, yeah, hey, let's, we're gonna do the right thing, and you're gonna do what you have to do because I yeah. did the wrong thing. 
But I mean, if I like, if I'm fishing or if I'm hunting, I usually am drinking too. So yeah, you're not you don't have a beer with you. I got I got freaking Gatorade. Dude. Exactly. So I was like, you don't have a beer <laughs> with you. So now I mean, everything you're doing is fine. So hey, hey. if I'm on my own property, I can drink beer if I want. But exactly. I'm out here, no drinking. <laughs> exactly. I try, I try to steer clear of beer all the way until I get home. Yeah, that's uh, I mean that's smart. And alcohol. They just. Or, I don't do drugs. I'm just saying guns, alcohol, drugs. Right. Those just lead yeah, you they down. Don't, That's they don't no mix. Bueno yeah, <laughs> exactly. I mean, and nobody wants to get their life ruined over just a little mistake. So over, I try over to tell a people. Over 16-ounce beer or something. Yeah, right? exactly. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, man. Exactly. Well, I'm not going to take every time fishing, no, brother, no, so you, you good, man. You, man. Yes, sir. Uh, Officer Hatley. Hatley? Nice yeah, brother. All right, bud. All right, nice to meet you, man. You have a good one.